the day, guys. We're doing a tournament. We're doing a knockout tournament of the of the top value 16 units in the game, including secret units. But it's going to be a flying tournament with the older bug DLC uh, kind of mod. So we've got the Artemis, Ice Giant, Da Vinci Tank. We've got the Tree Giant. We've got the Ulu. We've got the Sensei. We've got the uh, Giant Samurai. We've got the Shogun. And over here, we've also got the Pirate Queen, the Reaper, the Blackbeard, the Mammoth, the Zeus, the Monkey King, the Lady Red Jade, and the Cavalry. Look at him shaking his little booty for us. Yep, this is the battle today, guys. It's a straight knockout format. Let's get straight on to round one. Right, guys, the first battle tonight of the top 16 units with the highest values in the game, flying with a little bug DLC mod, is going to be the Artemis and the Cavalry. Let's see how this one goes. The numbers seem a bit imbalanced here. We've got the Cavalry. I don't know what the hell's going on here at all. This is going to be the most ridiculous tournament ever. I love it, though. Thank you for this um, Thank you for the suggestion, Anne-Marie. <laughs> this is a slightly strange one. The armors are looking like they're going to get pelters here from the Cavalry. This is the most bizarre thing I've ever seen. Flying horses and all sorts. I mean, what the hell is going on there? Right. That was, <laughs> that was a little bit brief. Okay. We're going to do best of three. I think this is pretty pointless doing this one best of three, to be quite honest. As you won. Let's see if the Artemis can do any better here. I, I thought the Artemis might do slightly better than this, if I'm being honest. I didn't think they were going to die quite as quick. But hey, you know, what happens, happens. I'm, anyone ever seen flying horses before? Probably not. Probably not. But hey, you know, first time for everything. They're not dying quite so quick this time. They've survived a little bit longer. Although, these flying horses are going to be a right pain in the backside for some units, aren't they, to deal with? Right, well, the cavalry got thrown on pretty easily. Right, second battle tonight. We've got Ice Giants versus Lady Red Jades. This is going to be interesting because there's clearly quite a big size difference here. Oh, look at these lovely little wings the uh, <laughs> the Ice Giants have got. I don't know who's going to win any of these battles. I, who knows? Who knows, who knows whether the quantity is going to be uh, winning over quality again? The Ice Giants... Oh, I don't know. The Ice Giants with a swing or, a swing or two are putting people down. Oh, man. Ice Giants gone. Is larger numbers going to be the way to go again? Put a punch in then, fella. Oh, you're going to get pasted here, aren't you? Oh, man, alive. Ice Giants, what's going on? I like the Ice Giants in these battles, but that's terrible. 1-0 down. Guys, I'm not fancying you, I'll be honest. I don't fancy your chances too much if you can't put any of them down quickly. Surely the Lady Road Jays, I guess, they're, I guess they're, not, they're not weak, are they, though? Oh, we've got one down. Good punch, but he's gone already again, man. Damn it. Damn it. Ice Giants, out in the first round by looking at it here. Lady Road Jays are just destroying them. Nah, they've, not got, they've got no chance, have they? What the hell? That was a pretty before... They got two down between them. Really? Kind of figured they'd do better than that. Well, that's there we go. Lady Red Jades go through. Ice Giants are gone. I'll be honest, I'm a little bit sad with this one. Because I've seen the Da Vinci tanks in action flying. And they're, they're pretty awesome. But you know I love the Monkey Kings. So, um, whoever goes out here, I'm going to be a little bit sad. If these guys get turned over, the Monkey Kings are in trouble, though. Oh, look at the Da Vinci tank. I, I do love the Da Vinci tank. Look at these beasts. Just <laughs> You've got to love them. You've got to love them. It's been upside down and it's become just weapons of just immense power. Monkey Kings are getting put down here a little bit. Oh, this one's in the balance. You know, this one's in the balance. I think Da Vinci tanks are a whole new level. Oh my god, they pasted them. Wow. Da Vinci tanks are a whole new level of dangerous with, with flying powers. They're, they're a bit weak on, their, on, the, on the floor. But oh my god, get them upside down in flying. Absolutely lethal. Can the Monkey Kings even come back in this one? Can I even put one of them down? The Da Vinci tanks seem unstoppable upside down. They put one down. Monkey Kings, come on. Let's have a battle here. Oh man, they're getting they're getting killed so easily. The guys are getting killed so easily. He's got stuck in this he's got stuck in it completely as well. Oh no! Wow, what can I say? Uh yeah. So that's Monkey King's gone. Right, good battle this one. Battle number four. We've got tree giants versus Zeus. God knows. Zeus or Tree Giants? Who's going through here? I don't know. Will the Tree Giants even get a shot in on them before they get destroyed by the lightning bolts? There's a lot of lightning bolts, to be fair. It's two, two Zeus's versus... Oh my god, they are batting them away like tennis balls. Tree Giants are destroy... Oh! Tree Giants absolutely destroyed them. What a lovely little photo that is. Look at these guys. What a photo that is. Right, round two. Can the Zeus's do it any better than they did in round one? Because that's pretty poor. Can they get back in this at all? I can't see it happening. I really can't, because they got absolutely annihilated in the first round. Get ready, Tree Giants. It's literally just batting them away. I'm going to try and get back over here. I'm going to try and zoom out so you can see how far they smash them. Oh, they are smashing them. Smashing them for home runs left, right, and center. Smashing them out of the park. That was an absolute pasting. Wow. Two nils to the Tree Giants. Right, because the Mammoth... Right, here we go. So, battle number five. Samurai Giants versus Mammoth. Mammoth with wings is going to be interesting. So, I've given the Mammoth sixth. 
six, six uh, units because otherwise they're going to be underpowered and the samurai giants are stronger. So we'll see what happens. Oh, look at their little wings. How cute are they? <laughs> I'm just, I mean, what is going to happen here? Uh, okay, they're getting destroyed pretty quick. I'm pleased I get the mammoth the extra unit because, oh, boys, I love a good mammoth, but they're, they're a bit weak on this game. I do feel that they, they need to be up. Their power, they need to have a bit more power about them. They feel weak to me. They feel like they should have a bit, a bit more strength to them than they have. They get killed too easily. Oh, no. What the hell's going on here? Oh, dear. Let's bomb them with round two. It's going to be... I think we know what's going to happen here. Poor old mammoths. Poor old mammoths. Oh, dear. They're going down so quickly. It's three on one over it. Can these guys at least... Can these two at least kill this one off? Let's not bother watching the other one. The other one's going to get destroyed. Can you, can you at least take this one down? Oh, anyone from died at all? Nah, look at the Samurai's are strong units. Oh man, Mammoth's got smashed. Right, next up we've got the Sensai's versus the Blackbeard. Interesting one, this one. Let's see what the Sensai's can do with their little nunchucky things. Oh, they're in on them like a shot. Oh, this is a good one. We've got the uh, the ninja star chucking skills of the Sensai's versus the outright anchor power of the... Oh, okay, the Reds destroyed them. There's a lot going on in that shot right there, my god. Good action shot of you dying. Losing your anchors. Wow, that was that was very one-sided again. My God, a lot of these battles are surprisingly one-sided so far. Round two. Come on, come on, pirate. Um, pirates? You are not pirates. You are blackbeards. Come on, the blackbeards. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Put a fight up against these sensais. You've been smashed again. What? Right, here we go. Next battle. The second last one of the first round. We've got the Ullas. I never had to actually say them. If you guys can tell me in the comments how you say this, please do. The Ullas versus the Reapers. Uh, I don't know how this one's going to go, but I think the, uh, my, my favouring would be with the Ullas here. Because the Reapers are a bit slow. We'll see. This isn't the most exciting battle, is it? It's all a bit laid back. Just throwing things out of a distance. Oh, the Reapers are doing very little. What's happened to the... What, what, is, what powers have the Ullas got? They're like... Just, oh, man alive. Reapers, this is poor, boys. That is poor. I'm going to be fair to the Reapers. I'm going to bring them in a bit closer for, for Battle 2 because I feel like they're so slow. I'll bring them in a bit closer, just to be fair. All right, we'll, bring, we'll give them a chance. There we go. To actually do something. You can't get in from there. You, you don't deserve to. Come on, Reapers. Just get on them at least. Here we go. Right, now at least you can get to them this time. So I'll, give them, I'll be fair. I'll give them a chance. If they lose this time, they deserve to lose anyway. Is this one any more even? Not really. The Reapers are still getting pasted, I think. Oh, man. Reapers are weak. Wow. The Ullers. Ullers. Ullers are through to the next round. Another 2 0 battle. A lot of a lot of dominating victory so far in this tournament. Right, I'll put a few more units in this one. Just try and balance the um, balance the uh, totals up as best I can. So we've got the Shoguns versus the Pirate Queens this time. Let's hope for a better battle. I feel like the battle's been a bit one sided so far. Let's see what we have here. I kind of want the Pirate Queens to get through because the Black Queens are terrible. It'd be nice to have a Pirate unit get through. <laughs> it looks like it might be the Pirate Queens because they've absolutely destroyed them here. Wow. Wow, that was a demolition job. Pirate Queens, you mullered them. Can't see the Shoguns. Based on that one, the Shoguns have got no chance here. But you never know, right? Nah, you do know. You know. When you know, you know. And you know they're going to get paces here again. Pirate Queens are taking them out. Oh, my word. They are gone. Another 2 0 -er. Some dominating victories. Still some dominates. That is the end of the first round. Right, this is the quarter-final stage. It's getting serious now. We've had dominating victories in the first round. Let's set the quarter-final step up a little. We've got the cavalry. I really want the cavalry to get through. They look awesome flying around. Versus the right Lady Red Jade. Let's see what happens here. Come on, cavalry. Blah, blah, blah. Come on, guys. Go crazy. Let's see. I want to see the cavalry. Oh, my God. They died really quick. <laughs> wow, they all died so quick. Charge, cavalry. You only got all of them to take out. My God. This is so one-sided. Jeez, Louise. Cavalry guys, step it up. Come on. I swear these battles in the air are more one-sided. Oh, they're going down so quick. I swear these cavalry these um these these aerial battles are ending a lot quicker than when they're on the, when they're like just battling on the floor. Oh that was a that was a painful dismount there. Oh he has been clobbered one there. <gasps> Yikes. Well that is the Lady Red Jade through to the semi-finals. The first semi-finalists are in place. Right next up we've got the Da Vinci tanks versus the tree giants. Battle of the heavyweights, two 4,000 uh, 4, point units. Can they get turned over before the tree giants get in? Here they go, raining them down. Can they keep them at bay, though? Can they keep the tree giants at bay? This is going to be a close one. Oh, this is going to be a close one. Can the Da Vinci tanks take them out before they get battered to pieces? Come on, Da Vinci tanks. 
Oh, it's going to be a closer one. Oh, Da Vinci Tanks take the first round. This is this is the first close one we've had pretty much the whole tournament. Right, one nil to Da Vinci Tanks. Can they take another one? Can the Tree Giants get enough blows and early doors? Or can Da Vinci Tanks take them down? Can I take them down? Oh, they're keeping the just about. A couple of good, good pelters in from the old Tree Giants could turn it around though. Oh my word, this is kicking off big time here, isn't it? This is looking like. Oh my god. Da Vinci tanks have found a whole new lease of life as upside down flying machines, haven't they? Tree giants are gone. Right, I'm looking forward to this one, guys. We've got the uh, Samurai Giants versus the Sensei. Based on them both demolishing their opponents in the first round, we're going to have the brute force Samurai Giants, or are we going to have the, the ninja star chucking skills of the Sensei getting through here? Can they throw enough in before they get to him? They're pinning them back with them, look. They can't even get close. They can't fly in. They can't get close to them. Wow. Oh my god, how many stars have they got in them all? Oh, literally just. Oh my god. This guy's about to take about another 20 to the chest as well. Wow. Okay. I'll, I'm going to be kind again. I'm going to give these guys a chance to be closer. I'm going to. I don't think it's going to make a slight bit of difference, but I'm going to give them a chance. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to give them a little bit of hope. Can they get closer here? I don't think they're going get, to get close again. Oh my god. Look at them just pumping them full of stars. Oh, it looks awful. Wow, Sensei is through. I tell you what, we're heading for a, a potentially very good final here. A very good final. Right, next up we've got the Illyrs. The Illyrs. Yep, that's how we're going to go with it. We're going to say the Illyrs versus the Pirate Queens. Again, who knows? Who knows? I'm going to fancy my money's on the older Illyrs here. The Pirate Queens is getting too slow to get forward. Come on, guys, get in there. You need to make some contact pretty soon here. Any contact, we've got some chance. Oh, we have, we've not had one close battle yet. They've all been very, very one-sided, these battles. What are these guys doing? Oh, man alive. Man alive. The Ullers have demolished him. So, as I've done in other battles, because they're slow, we'll move them close together. I'm not, I'm not being harsh here. I feel like it's only fair, bear in mind they're quite slow, to give them more of a chance and move them a bit closer in. It seems only fair to do it. Let's just whack these a bit closer. There we go. One, two, three, four. There's only five. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Right. We'll give them a chance. I don't think it's going to make much of a difference again. I think they're going to be pasted regardless. But hey, we'll see. If it makes it closer, I'll have to try and work something to make it fair in the last game. If they get beaten again, it's all irrelevant anyway. The Pirate Queens can't do anything, though. They can't. They, it's like they're completely ineffective in the air. He says as they suddenly go to town on the, on the Illyrs. Right, okay, I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do this last battle. Because <laughs> clearly, the long distance is, is unfair and close distance is... is... Alright, okay, we're gonna be, we'll, we'll, be, we'll be fair. What I'm going to do for the final battle, to try and be fair, we're going to have... I'll click on the right unit, that'll be useful. We'll have two rows, we'll have three there, and we'll have three behind them, alright? I'm trying to be as fair as I can. I'm sure someone's not going to like this, but it's tough, alright? I'm trying to be as fair as I can to give them a chance while trying to give the Ullers a chance as well, alright? It seems only reasonable to try and do that. Okay, that's where I'm going with it. If you don't like it, I'm sorry. Apologies. I've tried to make it fair. I'm very fair in my battles. I like to keep it all above board as best I can. Oh my god, they've rained down hell on them there, haven't they? They have rained down some hell on their others. Can you finish them off? No, I don't think you can. I think it's going to be Pirate Queens going through. I think it's going to be Pirate Queens. Unless this Ulla can do a lot. No, he can't. Pirate Queens are going to, are going to go through that one. I'm aware you're going to say that one's a bit controversial. I had to be as fair as I could. Right, it's the first semi-finals. We've got the Lady Red Jades versus the Da Vinci Tanks, who were unstoppable in the first two rounds. Let's see what they can do here. Can they put the Lady Red Jades at two? Over they go. Can they get the gun? The, can they get the older uh, bombs firing before the Lady Red Jades get right? Lady Red Jades get in there? Oh my God, they've gone down so quick. Two have gone down so quickly. These guys must have a seriously powerful attack. Oh wow, one nil to the Lady Red Jades. Oh, I want the Da Vinci Tanks to get through. I'll be honest, I'm a bit biased here. I, I love, I love their manoeuvring. Go on, guys. Turn over. Get firing rapidly. The Lady Red Jades are proving pretty tough. Oh, my God. A couple of a couple of shots. And they are gone. Come on, Da Vinci Tank. Come on. You've got four to fend off. Oh, no. Lady Red Jades are in the final. Sadly for me, and I'm sure you, some of you guys have as well, Da Vinci Tanks are bowing out in the semis. Very disappointing. Very disappointing. Right. Second semi-final, we've got the Sensei's who have been absolutely unstoppable against everyone so far versus the Pirate Queens. Let's see what happens here. I've got a feeling the Sensei's are going to be too much for them. They just... No one can get close to them, look. They, no one can even make, make a move on them in the air. Oh, just filling them, filling them full. Down they go. Oh my god, the Sensei's. Sensei's are beasts. 1-0. 
Can the Pirate Queen's Jonathan? I'm thinking probably not going to get close. Look at this. Just getting pasted. Look at the amount of uh, amount of stars getting. They're getting just pumped full of. Oh my god. They've got stars all, all over them. Poor people. Right, we've got Sensei's in the final. We have our finalists, guys. We have six Lady Red Jays who destroyed Da Vinci tanks in the semis versus the Sensei. Oh, we're a bit closer, aren't we? Versus the Sensei's who have just destroyed everything in front of them at all, at all times so far. It's four versus six to balance the old the costs up. Who is going to win here? Let's find out. Best of five in the final. Can the Lady Road Jays get any closer than anybody else? Because no one's got near them yet. Oh, they're getting some attacks in. Hello. Can can they take anyone down? Oh my god, Sensei's are just ridiculous. <sighs> One nil to the Sensei's, who at the very worst are having a lovely time. He looks like he's enjoying himself. On to round two. I think this is. <laughs> I think we know where this one's going. The Sensei is just. No one can get close to them. I can't. I can't put them much closer together. And the Lady Red Jays just can't do damage. Seemingly. I say that. I say that. They took two down there, but they are now two all down in the final. They've got one more chance. Can they get back in this? Can you get back in it, ladies? Can you get any any attacks in these on these guys at all? Get come on, throw some. Oh no, there's no. Not now you won't. We have our winners, guys. We have our winners. That was all bit one sided as well. Lady Red Jade, good effort. But these guys, these guys. Where's your head? Hello, where's your face? Guy hasn't gotten. Ah, oh, it's there. It's you've got no neck. You did well to aim, considering you can't see through your top. Anyway, that's beyond the point. These guys here, legends. And you, sir, you're a little no-neck legend as well. You're a no-neck legend. You guys, very close. Good effort. That is the tournament concluded. Anne-Marie, thank you for your suggestion. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you all had a nice time watching it. I'm sure you did. And yeah, until the next video, guys, I will catch you then. Don't forget to smash the old like button, subscribe button if you enjoyed it that much. Leave me a comment. Come and say hello, and I'll say hello back. It'll be awesome and all that. And until next video, guys, cheers or bye.